Yo, what's up guys, it's the girl Antisocial, and I'm going to be doing a highly requested reading on John Moore. This video is for entertainment purposes. If you are a new viewer, a new subscriber, yes, the camera is also just listen to my voice. Um, I just wanted to say for my subscribers that are complaining about the smoke detector, I have high ceilings. That's my mother's excuse, the high ceilings, but we are going to get that shit changed. Don't worry. Okay, let's just get started. So... Like I predicted, John Moran is in some bullshit. Um, I don't think he's going to have a long NBA career, to be honest with you, just because of how he carries himself, um, unless he really changes. Spirit, what's John Moran's energy? We're just going to get into it. It's going to be a short-ass reading because I don't really think this should be long. I don't really see much for him, to be honest. Um, what's going on with John Moran? What's his energy? What's his energy? What's his energy? What's John Moran's energy, Spirit? What is John Moran's energy? What is John Moran's energy? What is John Moran's energy? We have the Nine of Pentacles in the back of the deck. We got the Nine of Wands, the Chariot card, the Knight of Wands, the Seven of Cups, the Judgment, and the Death card. So with the Nine of Pentacles in the back of the deck, John Moran is very content. He lives a luxurious lifestyle. Um, he's not really pressed about a lot of shit. Um, he kind of has like a calm um aura when it comes to drama um yes he can get wild too but this shit don't really press him that much um with the nine of wands and the cherry card it talks about him um setting boundaries and being very overprotective of himself um the cherry card him still persevering and doing whatever he wants um he has this very very much like kind of like um cocky arrogant energy um i can't be touched type energy and that's kind of what gets him in trouble nine of wands um him being very passionate seven of cups temptation and the temptation and him trying to figure out how to fix this drama how to make it up to the public um, the judgment card talks about redemption, um, forgiveness, and the death card talks about transformation changing. So John Moore is trying to figure out how to fix what he did, um, trying to get the public to like him. That's really what he cares about, to be honest. Ace of Swords, Two of Cups, Three of Pentacles. Um, he's trying to figure out how to... Something tells me that the grilly, that the Grizzlies, whatever partnership John ja Moran has, it's like they're 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 fed up. They're fed up with him, and with the Ace of Swords, it's like he's creating nothing but conflict. Um, the Two of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. It's kind of like they're gonna try to figure out how to fix this shit. Um, and it's like he's still learning too. Two of Swords, Indecision, Four of Pentacles, keeping to himself, High Priestess. The thing about it is, he's not stupid. John Moore knows better. He's not dumb. He's not stupid. But it definitely talks about Two of Swords, Avoidment, Four of Pentacles, keeping to himself. So he could be over social media for a minute. Um, High Priestess, he's very smart. He's very knowledgeable. Um, is he a college graduate? Can someone answer this? If not, he had good grades in school. Um, yeah. That's his energy right now. Um, the thing about it is, his energy is weird. It's like, with the Nine of Pentacles in the back of the deck, deck he can be a chill person. He can. But it's like, 
out of nowhere, this, 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 this arrogant, chill, you know, I can't be touched um, aura comes in. And once again, with the Knight of Wands, he's on defensive mode. So he could take up for himself. Um, he could have his guard up behind the scenes, you know? Um, well, John Morant have a long career, Spirit. It depends how he handles everything. Will John Morant have a long career? Will John Moore have a long career? <coughs> Will John Moore have a long career, Spirit? Four of Pentacles, Chariot Card, Nine of Swords, Nine of Cups, Six of Wands, Knight of Cups, Eight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, King of Wands. Um, from what I'm getting, from what I am getting, with the four pentacles in the back of the deck, it talks about saving money and security. So he's not going to have that much money. He's not going to have... Okay, okay. And, and what he was promised, not in our standards, and what he was promised in NBA career stats, he's not going to have that much money with the four pentacles in the back of the deck. And it, it, it's, it's giving that he knows that. Um... He's not going to have as much money as LeBron. He's not going to have as much money as um, anybody that has high standard contracts. The, the money that he's promised, he's not getting all that because he's fucking it up. He's legit fucking it up. With the chariot card and the nine of swords, it talks about him persevering, him have, him being determined um, a nine of swords, him having anxiety, depression, hopelessness, nine of cups, him partying, contentment. Um, so he still is going to live a luxury lifestyle, but it talks about him being, um, him having anxiety because people are, are going to be on his back. Um, six of wands, public recognition, um, him being in the spotlight, nine of cups, creativity, um, eight of wands, perseverance, traveling, so he's still going to be in the NBA. Page of Pentacles. There are going to be opportunities coming to him in the future still, though. Um, Seven of Pentacles. Perseverance. So from what it looks like, he is going to have... He could have a long career. Um, but he won't be... The money that was promised to him, he's not getting all of that. They're definitely taking, like, 50% of that away from him. Um, King of Cups. Sun card the death card he definitely could change high priestess knight of wands and we could see it three of pentacles he definitely is going to try to change and there's definitely collaborations with him in the future um queen of swords temperance card he has feminine energy also yeah he's definitely going to try to change for sure um he won't be getting as much money as promised though but he could have a long career it definitely talks about change um, is there any more drama for John Morant? Hopefully he doesn't get dropped from any teams or anything or any endorsements. He probably will get dropped from endorsements. Is there any more drama for John Morant? I don't see him having the best NBA career. I don't. 
Like the money that was promised him, he's not getting that. A lot like endorsements can be cut off. But it's not going to stop him. Um, I do see a change and I do see like him getting money in the future, you know. Is there any more drama for John Moore? You know what's crazy? I legit said there was going to be a lot of NBA news on the blog, which is crazy. We have the Page of Pentacles, the High Priestess, the Seven of Swords, the Six of Cups, the Full Card, the Ace of Swords. Yes, yes. There's forever going to be bullshit with John Moore. Um, Page of Pentacles, it definitely talks about him trying to develop himself. Um, so while he's on this journey, there's always going to be bullshit with John Moore. With the High Priestess, even though he knows better with the High Priestess, with the Seven of Swords... Um, it's kind of like the people around him aren't the best people. And his team is going to be trying to hide a lot of shit from him with the Seven of Swords. Um, he's going to do a lot of shit and they're going to try to keep it under wraps. Six of Cups, um, Six of Cups in the Fool card. He is going to be on a journey. Um, especially, I'm pretty sure his team, um, fucking suspect, like, He's not playing any games right now. Um, so when he does get back with the Six of Cups, he's going to be everlasting doing bum shit, um, dumb shit. Full card, Ace of Swords, there definitely is conflict. Um, judgment card, he's going to be dragged out of public. Knight of Swords, he's going to try to redeem himself. Five of Pentacles, he's going to lose a lot of fucking money. Um, and with the Ten of Swords... The other talks about betrayal, crisis, defeat, him feeling defeated. Five of Swords, he needs to change his circle, moon card. People are jealous of him. People are jealous of him. They're jealous of him. They really are jealous of him. Um, moon card, he knows what he's doing is wrong, but it's kind of like Two of Swords, avoidance of changing himself. Four of Pentacles, Four of Cups. I'm feeling bad. Six of Pentacles, giving a charity, the devil, temptation, the emperor card, Two of Pentacles. What's a priority? So, it's definitely going to be a journey for John Morant. Um, he could change in the future, or he's going to try to change, but temptation is going to fuck him over. Yes, there is more drama coming. There's going to be drama within and out his career. Um, he could definitely he he could even fight somebody on the court or like behind the scenes. But there's definitely is continuous drama coming for him. It's going to affect his pockets, his money. He's going to lose a lot of money in his career. A lot of money that was promised to him. Um, he could try to change, but if he doesn't, I don't see him getting the money that's promised. But there you guys have it. This was the reading on John Moore. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and peace.